Hello YouTube. Today is the day I try to do the Teeny Whoop modification to my E010 micro quadcopter. Right now I'm showing you everything that you kind of need to do this particular mod. Uh, I do have a small micro screwdriver to mount this 3D printed holder for the micro camera. Uh, I went with the holder versus doing a hot glue or something like that because it's a little bit cleaner and it makes it a little bit more stable. And this is the camera that I chose to put on there. It's a micro camera and it has the dip switches settings on the back to choose the channels and all that good stuff. Uh, it's kind of small and difficult to see but trust me it is there okay now um, in the video I'm going to um, set up and pretend the connections and my clock let me know it's time to get rolling anyway I'm going to pretend the connections. I'm not going to show you how to do that. That's pretty, that's just common um, soldering skills. Just make sure you pretend your connections with uh, solder before you attempt to connect those connections. They're kind of small. And also, you're going to need a real fine soldering point. Uh, so, here we go. Uh, first of all, the quadcopter. I'm not going to need the controller right now, so I'll move that out of the way. But here's the quadcopter, and I usually keep all this stuff in the packaging so I can put it in a small container that I get from the dollar store and keep all my small quads in there. And you can just pop it off from the sides right there, and the canopy comes off. Now I've seen other mods where people have put the camera back on. Not sure if I'm going to do that just yet, but it, it just comes right off. And what we're going to do is remove this one screw right here so we can mount this 3D printed uh, mounting plate right on top of that like that. Um, open it. I just got it the other day, so it looks like a... Um, It'll just fit face up where the camera will fit in that slot and it's going to fit just like that. Now there are other holes in this, I'm not going to use them. And I'm going to fit this with a small uh, rubber bands to the holder. That way the, it won't rock back and forth or be able to lose the actual camera and I'll show that in the end. Um, there is a small capacitor here so I'm gonna need some a small bit of foam right here to equal the size of the capacitor so it's not rocking back and forth in flight. Uh, the soldering ports we're gonna use is right here. One is positive one is negative and I'm going to make sure that I have it correctly on this back side if you look down in between those two you'll see the positive negative and we'll use red as positive and black as negative. Okay, just a moment and let me get that mounted. Okay, just to show you, I cut a piece of foam and equal it to the um, capacitor there that will allow it to be level. So, just want to show that before I mounted it and screwed it all down. Okay, I do have it mounted now and had a little trouble getting it in the mounting but I think I have it in there now the next part is to tin these wires pre-tin these wires here and the two connections where it's going to go and we'll solder them in. I'm going to go ahead and tin and solder it and the next thing you'll see is it actually connected okay YouTube I've finished soldering it's a little tough but I got both points soldered as you can see uh, let that focus for a little bit 
I gotta increase my uh, soldering skills a little bit, but I did get a solder. And I took some Velcro and split it and ran around in this groove and was able to secure it under the bottom. I'm gonna trim that a little bit, make it a little, little better, but it seems to hold it in place just fine and allows me to be able to remove it later if need be. So here is the mod for the teeny whoop. Next is the test flight, and I will show a little bit of that also. This is Mayday. I just popped back on just to show how it's connected and it is getting power if you see that. And I just left it on the default channel. Um, and what I actually see within the fat shark, I'm not sure if I can show that really well on the camera, but it is receiving. So I'm going to give it a little test flight and see how it flies. This is Mayday.